Welcome to PS Desire Photoshop and Photography Tutorials. My name is Ishwar. In this tutorial, I will show you how to achieve dark and moody tones to your photographs like Tony Mafood, Short Stash, Sam Cordler. If you look into this particular photographer's Instagram accounts, you will find lot of dark and moody tones, particularly desaturated kind of color effect in all the photographs. Today, I will show you the how to achieve the same effect in Photoshop in most easy and possible way. This image has the greens, blues and the reds so that this image is best example to achieve these dark tones color effect. First of all, we would like to create a color harmony so that the greens and blues look the same color. We can do that using channel mixture. Select the blue channel and make the blues invisible so that keep the blue percentage to 0%. Now you will notice that the background greens and the blue colors are exactly the same. Now we can change the greens color. Select green slider and increase it and keep it at 100% so that the all the greens are turned into cyan color and also the blues now we have the cyan and the reds now we are going to apply the orange tones to the skin tone select selective color select neutrals because the most of the skin tones are neutral so we are going to change the neutrals in the selective color and Particularly cyan, if you add the cyan color, it will add the cyans to the skin tones. The opposite of the cyan is magenta which is a kind of red color. So that we will add some reds to the skin tones. Now go to the reds and we will change the reds to the oranges and by sliding the yellow color to the 100 so that it will add some orange tones. Still there is lot of reds in the skin tones so that we will drag some little cyan's to 50% it will change the reds to oranges if you want add some of the yellows to the skin tone you can go to the neutrals and add little bit of yellow so that it will add some yellows to the skin tone now we achieved the cyan and the orange tones. Now we are going to desaturate the cyans to give some moody and dark tone effect. Go to adjustments and select hue and saturation and select cyans. Now we are going to desaturate the cyans. Simply select the saturation slider and drag it backwards so that it will desaturate the cyan's. In this case, I will keep it at minus 70 and I am happy with the desaturated look. Now I am going to add some contrast to the image. To do that, I am going to add some gradient map. Select the black to white gradient and change the blending mode to soft light. I, I don't want to add the contrast to the highlight part so that select the layer mask go to image and apply image select the invert option so that the contrast effect is only applied to the darker areas of the image uh, leaving the highlights area untouched click ok to apply the changes now the contrast effect was too strong i would like to Reduce it by lowering the opacity way down to around 25%. We almost finished the effect. Now I'm going to add a little bit sharpness to the image. Duplicate the background layer and move the layer to the top of the stack, layer stack and go to filter and select high pass filter. Keep the radius amount very small to keep the fine details and click OK 
now change the blending mode to overlay that's it we are done here is before and after thanks for watching i hope you found this video useful don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more interesting tutorials i will catch you next time take care